News Channel 8, non-stop local news. 9.32 and coming up here, ghostly beef stew and terrorific tomato soup. Uh. <laughs> Kid likes it, he's a fan. We'll show you how to create a haunted Halloween dinner in 20 minutes or less. <laughs> well, between trekking home from work to get the kids fed into their costumes and out the door, Halloween is quite a balancing act for parents. Yeah, absolutely. But you can still serve a festive, spooky supper in no time at all. Jessica Brader of the 6 o'clock Scramble is here to show us how. Welcome, yeah, Jess. Thanks. Thanks for having me back. We've been admiring some of your little <laughs> treats that you have out here. Yeah, so I have three meals to show you guys today. Okay. And um, some of them take 20 minutes or less, and then some you can do in the slow cooker so that it can be done really quickly and easily that way. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was going to say, you got to be super efficient. On your game. All right, these game. are super cute. Yeah, so yeah. these are jack-o'-lantern pizzas. Mm -hmm. And the thing that makes these really fun is that instead of tomato sauce, you've got sweet potato sauce. Whoa. And so what you're going to do is you're going to saute some onion, some garlic, and grated sweet potato so it cooks really fast. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then that takes about 10 minutes. Then you top it with some orange cheese to make it look like pumpkin. <laughs> and then everyone can build their own little faces with bell peppers or olives mm -hmm. or whatever fruits and veggies you've got at home. All right. That's super easy. Yeah. And like you said, 20 minutes. 20 minutes, you're done. Gets the kids involved mm -hmm. as well. Yes. All right. Okay. This is so cute. Yeah. yeah. So this is witch's fingers with terrific tomato soup. Ooh. <laughs> I know. Spooky. It does look spooky. That <laughs> finger is like really. Yeah. Just... So basically, I'm going to put you to work. Okay. okay. So basically, what we're going to do is we're just going to take a little piece of the dough here. Okay. And you really want it to be small because it will puff up. Okay. And you're going to roll, roll it out. out. Okay. And this is just a pizza dough. You could also do a breadstick dough. Mm -hmm. Really simple. Okay. And then you're just going to stick that into one tip as your fingernail. Ha ha ha. And then you just bake them for 10 <laughs> minutes. Yeah. And, done. and then the soup is just a tomato bisque, basically. So okay. it's. What you're going to do is you're going to saute some onions in some melted butter mm -hmm. and then throw in a little bit of flour to make a paste. Okay. And so again, you, something you can do when you have a little bit of time and then just reheat tomorrow. It actually only takes 20 minutes. Yeah. There you oh, go. So Perfect. Super easy. And you can also do it in the slow cooker. Mm -hmm. So you're just going to create a white sauce uh -huh. and then put in the tomatoes, heat up, puree, and you're done. And you're done. Easy peasy. Easy. And I was going to say something like this and then, it, you know, we'll get to the stew as well. Yeah. But, mm -hmm. you know, these are going to be, it's going to be kind of cool it's tomorrow. Be chilly. You want yep. something that's going to be you know kind of exactly. warm and hearty and I uh, definitely want to get the dinner in because candy is yes. probably yes, not acceptable absolutely. as candy is filled up as much as you can okay exactly. so now what is this called so little... this is the ghostly beef stew okay and so this is a great one for the slow cooker or to make tonight because stews always taste better the next, the next day. day absolutely yeah. so what you're going to do is you're going to make your stew okay and then we're going to make the pipe out the ghost so all you do is take some whipped potatoes and, and then you, would you do this cut like up a tip. you would do with icing. Exactly, it's just like icing. Yeah, exactly. Okay. And so then, I'm gonna, you want to try it? There yeah, you go. here, Julie, okay. you want to no, make no, no, a ghost? No, 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 you do it, you sure? <laughs> okay. And you're just going to squeeze it out like you would a cupcake. Okay. In a little circular motion. Uh -huh. And then when you get it to the, oh, uh -oh. When, you get, when you get it to your, yeah. And oh, then that's just cute. Uh, poke it up. Okay. And then okay. you can take little peppercorns. Give me that. Okay. And uh -huh. you can make eyes. Little eyes. And you can right do this with capers here. or with little pieces of carrot it would also okay. work really well. Yeah. Anything like that. That's oh, super fast. Oh, that's not bad. No, that's not bad great. at all. I was gonna say yours look a, a little more perfect, but that's what you're supposed to do. It's supposed right. to be a little scary. Well, exactly. yeah. No, ghosts are like snowflakes. No two are the, ever the same. Exactly. Oh, that's so perfect. Oh my God, these fun? are gonna be so, so perfect. Yeah. Try, try, so try, please try. try. Yeah. Love. Yeah. Oh, yummy. And again, like I mean. So this mm. is what you need before the kids go out trick or treating. Exactly. Warm up their little bellies, fill those up. bellies, mm -hmm. so there isn't as much room for candy. Oh, <laughs> exactly. This is great ideas. Yeah. So they're really fun. They're really easy. Yeah. And they can be done, like I said, ahead of time or in 20 minutes or less. In 20 minutes. Yeah. And it gets the kids involved too, even better. Exactly. And I was going to say, uh, website for people to get these recipes. Yes. <laughs> so all of these are available at our website, thescramble.com, okay. mm -hmm. where we have a Halloween survival guide that you can download to get all the recipes, along with tips on how to manage all the candy afterwards. Perfect. Ooh, brilliant. Okay. And this yeah. is delicious. <laughs> I'm so glad you like it. Eileen has lunch now. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. 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 You we're read. Gonna, <laughs> we're going to show you what's trending right after the break, so stay with us. Coming up here at 942. <laughs> this is so good. Because you're mine.